So where are we now? Did we get to what you wanted or is there something more? Well, I think we got mostly there. It's just how can we work our way through that resistance with wording because it's not about the wording so much it's, it's how we feel I understand words that. sometimes can help but what it really is is when you are aware that there is resistance stop trying to push through it because trying to push yourself through it just makes more resistance so it just gets worse so it really is about surrendering. This is what you wanted to talk about. It really is about giving up. Oh, never mind. I can do this later. Oh, never mind. Never mind. This isn't the right time for that. Oh, never mind. Allowing. Esther has had printed some cards that go on the dash of the car. Would you like one? Yes. She'll send them to you. <laughs> the card, you can't read it when you look at it but it reflects on the windshield so you can read it and it says things are always working out for me 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 she has it on all of her cars things are always working out for me one day she took three cars to the car wash because it was the day she was washing cars so she took one down took another one down and the man said oh it's so nice to see you again and Esther's thinking oh thank you <laughs> and he said I recognize the card on your dash because <laughs> he had not seen anything like that before things are always working out for me that's an affirmation worth making things are always working out for me do you believe it yes do you yes. do you really yes. things are always working out for me yeah yes. you believe that yes really yes. things are always working out for me yes. things are always working out for me things are always working out for me taking their damn sweet time sometimes <laughs> <laughs> we heard you <laughs> things are always working out for me so if that statements too strong then say things often work out for me I'm often aware that things are always working out for me that's a sort of more true statement I'm often aware that things are always working out for me sometimes I realize that things are always working out for me I like it when I'm aware that things are always working out for me the more I'm aware that things are always working out for me the more things are working out for me I don't need to focus upon the condition of things working out in order to know or expect things are working out for me I'm beginning to trust in my own well-being I'm beginning to trust in my own worthiness I can feel that I am the object of the attention of source of non-physical energy I can feel that there are a whole lot of non-physically focused beings who have my back I can feel that things are working out for me I can feel that I could let things work out for me even more as I let go of the things that are bothering me I can help things work out for me in a more conscious way by being consciously aware that things are always working out for me they don't seem like they're always working out for me but deep down I know that they are always working out for me and when something isn't working out for me next I'm gonna say things are always working out for me I just got to relax and allow the path of least resistance to move it along things are always working out for me things are always working out for me no regrets no bad steps no wrong steps I can't get it wrong I'm never gonna get it done the reason that it's not ever wrong is because it's never done I'm in the right place at the right time things are always working out for me things are always working out for me let's take it further source adores me source adores me my inner being adores me I am so loved I am so loved look at this planet spinning in its orbit in perfect proximity to other planets things are so working out for us oh they keep telling us something's gonna hit us they keep telling us we're gonna go out of orbit they keep telling us that things are going wrong but things are always working out for us they keep telling us that the droughts gonna come and it's never gonna rain again and now we're on the streets in our boat <laughs> things are always working out things are always working out I could smooth the flow out by trusting that more I could smooth the flow out I could have less flood and less drought I could smooth the abundance out I could allow things to come to me more smoothly I could smooth out my path of least resistance I could make it lesser and lesser resistance it's so that when I have an idea of something I want it can come to me swiftly and speedily it doesn't have to take as long as it is it's all right that it does you see what we're getting at and aren't these words calming and reassuring and couldn't you find them if you wanted to and don't you want to yes don't you want to really know that things are always working out for me so someone says how did you get to where you are tell me about yourself and you say instead of no 
you could say things are always, always working, working out for me things are always working out for me things are always working out for me what do you mean oh it's too long of a story to tell I'm just a thriver I'm just a thriver I think I may be the most blessed person on the planet things are always working out for me how'd you get there don't know but I'm glad I'm here <laughs> it happened so gradually I can't even remember just seems like for a really long time I've been thriving I don't really like to see you thriving that much because I'm not thriving things are always working out for you too things are always working out for all of us oh yeah well I don't see that a lot of people don't but then they don't thrive do you mean to tell me yeah <laughs> yeah that's what I mean to tell you things are always working out for us things are always working out for us and to the degree that we know that and trust that and relax into that then things do work out for us how'd you get there well I surrendered I stopped trying to prove my worthiness I just accepted it I stopped trying to defend my position I just held it I stopped trying to explain myself to those who cannot hear my explanation that's big yeah. mother <laughs> I don't think that you're going to understand so I'm just not going to explain myself starts early doesn't it yeah my inner being is my dominant partner of alignment there are a lot of things you can't say to most people they're not going to hear it so you've got to go general happiness is my nature I feel like I'm supposed to feel good I sure like feeling good I would so much rather feel good than not wouldn't you well yeah <laughs> wouldn't everybody yes everybody would rather feel good and I believe we all can feel good it's just a matter of focus do you mean under any condition you mean you can feel good no matter what yes well what about that I don't look at that well then you can't feel good under any circumstance no I'm unconditionally happy I don't focus at conditions that are awful and expect to feel good that doesn't seem smart I focus upon conditions that are wonderful and then I feel good oh so you've got your head in the sand pretty much <laughs> pretty much I'm focusing on things that feel good because feeling good seems to be why things are always working out for me because I've given up the struggle I've given up the battle I've given up the blame that's a big one I've given up the blame given up the guilt that's even bigger given up the guilt how'd you get there I don't know I'm just here I'm just here well explain to me how you got there really don't want to I might go back just moving forward living happily ever after happily ever after not happily before happily ever after <laughs> happily ever after I'm living happily ever after yeah enough thank you yeah yeah